Hey guys, John Boy McCracken here. You know, today I want to talk about uh, the mistreatment of uh, trans uh, folks and the like, you know. Really just, uh, you know, LGBT uh, sorts. Uh, and, you know, over the years I've been... Uh, the, uh, the victim of uh, innumerable uh, hate crime incidents, you know? Good for you. You ensured that whole thing wouldn't happen for me because you were jealous. You were jealous of, of my outcome. You know, nothing good, nothing good happens to people like you. So they architected this entire thing to try to make me fed up with women, huh? Oh. Meanwhile, I passed by all these really great women. Isn't that something? Thanks. Thanks a million. Yeah, they really know what they're doing. Yep. Wonderful. Yeah, they don't, they don't want people like me around in the future, and that's all it is. They don't want anybody remotely like me. They just want their rotten fucking stability. They're all delusional in the extreme. <laughs> These fucking morons. These fucking morons. See, yeah, they, they know I'm gonna... They know I have high, high potential. They know that I'm gonna do something great. But give them a chance. Something that's gonna make them lose some power. That's all it is. That's all it is. These people are absolute creeps. They're beyond evil. They belong in hell. That's where they're going. Oh, well, yeah. Yes, but you know, always. Nothing I've talked about there has any reality. Oh, you're right. Yes, yes, I keep, keep, keep listening to those primitives. We tell you, tell you about these little psychological theories as though Freud and Carl Jung are still alive. Yeah, they know everything. Yeah. Now this isn't the 21st century or anything. Hell, it could be the fucking 1950s and what I'm saying has validity. You know that? Yeah, you know, nobody's been poisoning me. It's just the, uh, this little, uh, little valve thing. It's, it's got a just my muscles probably uh, wind up the, uh, the torsion spring, or what's that kind of spring, in a clock. Anyway, anyway, I felt it opening. I mean, it's totally unnatural. There's no anatomical structure, or, uh, no gland or anything that does that. It's, uh, you know, it was, it was poisoning me. Yeah. I felt my, cheek, uh, my, my teeth get all chalky, and it felt whittled down, and... Yeah, they're punishing me. They're just punishing me. Yeah, they don't think I deserve it. Yeah. Yeah, people like me should exist. We have too much of an advantage. Yeah. Yeah, see, our ancestors, uh, you know, they must have endured too many things, you know, where their survival was at stake and they developed, you know, better uh, uh, previsioning. You know, so they knew what was going to happen, you know. Yeah, people like me have an obscene advantage over all the rest of these, these, these fucking slow, dim-witted freaks. So, you know, yep. Oh, it's okay for me to be their slave, though, yeah. Yep. No, none of this makes any sense. These are, these are the rantings and ravings of a crazy man. I'm not raving, though, but I'm, I'm ranting. Yeah, of a crazy man. Well, good luck. Good luck with your little future. Good luck. It's going to be real fun. Just nothing but a lot of long teeth. Long teeth dripping blood. Hooray. Hooray for progress. There's not going to be any real progress. It's just all going to, it's all going to crossle inward. You know? Like a, like a spiral staircase to hell. Everywhere you look, you know, oh, here's another, here's another spiral staircase down to hell. Oh, <laughs> well, I, I can go down a few flights. 
Yeah, I, oh, okay. Now let's see, what, 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 is, what do the readings show? Okay. Well, I, I know about these technologies. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh, oh, oh! That's how it's going to be. So enjoy that. Enjoy that. Amen. Amen for the future. Hurrah, hurrah, hooray, hooray. Tra la 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 la. High in this direction. Um, yeah, it's, it's, you know, at the same level. <sighs> yeah, you know, yeah, they, they, they did shut it off early. I mean, you know, they shut it off. Uh, yesterday, yesterday afternoon, they were, they were cooking me for a little bit. Then they shut it off. When they heard me talking about it, what was going on? Didn't have a camera handy. Yeah, still, uh, still high and steady. Uh, yeah, and I felt told it just flowing through me, you know, just flowing through me. But now it's, you know, there's one over there as well. So that's interesting. I mean, this should, you know, constitute evidence of a crime. I slipped in my truck and it was, uh, I woke up and I'm hearing this song on, this verse on repeat. I try so hard. Get into the weeds. I try so hard. Get into, get into the weeds. You know, I think it would be absolutely marvelous to reenact uh, uh, my little uh, uh, adventure uh, back in, uh, what was it, 1968. Yeah, that was after the damage had been done. Um, I came to find out that uh, old Jeffrey, you know, he was on the same karmic path as myself. You know, uh, and I gave him a, you know, a good sized, uh, you know, palm sized piece of hematite. You know, I actually kept that as a weapon. You know, you could throw it or club somebody, you know. Small enough, I mean, if it's in your hand, you could hit them in the, the mastoid process, you know, and just. Yeah, they'll go down like a sack of potatoes. And after that, you typically have, you gotta kill them because you've done way too much damage. Anyway. So, I, you know, I gave him that. And then I did a hypnotic uh, regression. And, um, you know, I, anyway, <laughs> came to find out he'd been targeted like a, by a, a satanic cult run by the CIA. And, you know, he was a MK Ultra victim, basically. Anyway, you know, he, he was the kind. He got real innovative with his, uh, you know, I mean, well, he, this, this one didn't. I guess the Mandela effects haven't caught up because, uh, you know, I just checked, I mean, and uh, I guess he's dead. He was beat to death in a, in, in, in a prison cell, so he's not the same one I dealt with. We're, we're getting back in sync uh, here soon, and this, this little video should be obsolete. It should just disappear, I mean. So basically, I, I intercepted him as he was riding uh, uh, back home uh, from school one day, and, and um, I, I just showed him a smartphone, you know, I showed him a, a, a video I had I downloaded, you know, it was a, a, a this, 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 this anime, you know, and he was really enthralled by that, and he, you know, he asked me all these questions about it, and uh, you know, I, I said, yeah, you know, there's more back in my camp, and I, you know, we went back there, and, it's just as I suspected, and it just, uh, oh boy, it was, uh, it was quite emotional, you know. Uh, it was, I really felt sorry for the kid, and uh, anyway, in this split-off uh, 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 dimension, he, um, he's, he runs a Tesla dealership in uh, Utah, of all places. He became a Mormon, and um, anyway, he's a very successful guy, very business-minded. I mean, you would just never think that about him. We made this big art project, you know, to protect him from the the microwave emitter they were using, you know, and um, yeah, just a lot, a lot of copper screening, some some pieces of uh, rough hematite, and we, we just we just bound those to the screening with the with the uh, copper wire. And, 
I amplified things, put some corks in there. Uh, I cut these these pieces out of cast old cast iron uh, 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 cook cookware. You know all these different bird shapes mainly. You know Jeffrey he kind of kind of likes birds for some reason. Oh, it's the air side. He's a you know he's a Gemini. He's a Taurus Gemini uh, cusp uh, kind of character. I cut those out with a laser. That little laser. Uh, you know, I wanted to go kill those men, but you know, you know, you gotta, you gotta watch what you change, and you know. Anyway, he was all right, but his mother went further south and couldn't do anything to help her. Uh, you know, unfortunately, only went in there a couple of times, helped him out with it, and you know, you just passed it off as an art project, you know, something he'd made in shop class. Big success story, and, and we'll see if it uh, catches up, and and if it does, this whole thing's just going to get skewed to ruin, and uh, I really, I'd like to make the movie, though. I mean, how are we going to... Which room is he staying in? Uh, there's the one right across this, and he's right there. Oh, that's interesting. That is interesting. What does he look like? Oh, uh, like he's drunk. <laughs> he just looks like a drunk. He's got the red face, and I'm looking. Oh, okay, he's so he's, so he's, he's white? Huh? He's white? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tall or what? Uh, is he bald or what? Uh, I mean, he's always wearing a hat. Uh, he's wearing a hat. It looks like maybe he's got blonde hair or something. Okay. Maybe he's just a really red face, and when he slurs, you know, he, he talks like a... Even when he makes some kind of... He talks like a fucking drunk. Uh, so. But no, he's definitely drunk. Yeah, he's definitely drunk. Yeah, he's definitely drunk. Yeah, he's definitely Well, he came out uh, last, uh, two or three days ago when I was, I was watching TV at like 1.30 in the morning, and he, he walked all the way up and fucking... The, the... Whatever you want to call it, you know, out there on the TV is fucking... In his boxes, and fucking stood, stood at the door and didn't even go outside to smoke a cigarette. <laughs> Hmm. That's not the cigarette. I don't care. What is that, one of your RF reader thingies? Um, oh, it's a, it's a type of radionics machine. Like, radionics machines, they're like, um, actually, the first ones uh, were invented in the, and built in the, 1890s, actually, when they were like first like doing all these experiments like with like, like, yeah, yeah, well, people like Edison, Tesla. people like Ed Tesla and Edison, and all all kinds of folks were were, were doing experiments with electromagnetism, and they they using electromagnetism for uh, for healing, and uh, for uh, they figured out oh well you could use it to, to kill people of course, and uh, and then the, you know of course they some of the people discovered you could heat heat water and. Heat, heat the water and cellular material, you know, and uh, so you can 
make a microwave oven, which, you know, the first ones came out in the, uh, in the 1950s. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Microwaves were in the 50s? Yep. First, first commercial ones. Yeah. I mean, before that, of course, the, I'm sure some scientists and right. rich people might have had them in, uh, in, the, in, in the 30s or the 20s yeah. or whatever. You know. I, I gotta imagine it, it, didn't, it didn't really resemble much of what we think of a microwave. It's probably really uh, large, bulky. Oh, yeah, large. really large. Yeah, yeah. They're really a lot, a lot more mechanical than fucking. Uh, yeah, I can almost see having to like turn a hand crank off because it didn't have its own power source, probably. Oh, yeah, they just hook it up to a generator. Sure, they hook it up to a generator. Yeah, you know, or the 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 power supply. Yeah, they they had the they had this they had power in the cities. Yeah, they hook up to the power plant. It's still amazing how far we've come in just you know a little over a hundred years. You know, yeah, yeah, it is, but it's uh, it's like back in like the twenties, people were thinking about people probably could have gone into some kind of utopian situation, but some people didn't want that. Like uh, you know, uh, like the oh J P Morgan and the the Ro Rockefeller John D right. Rockefeller and Ponce. right that, yeah they just want to keep doing their yeah. working with the the old fashioned uh, sure. stuff. Uh, but the, the greed is the, yeah it's just know, greed and control and yeah. yeah. I mean, they had so many plans, and well, they had to, you know, sy systematically, you know, build society up, and it's like, you know, a lot of competition. And, I still think it's crazy. There's secrets in the world where people can't get fresh, like they, they have to walk miles for fresh water. And they fucking do like. Uh, oh yeah, that you know, was, they fucking, we, we can't even feed all the people on the earth. And like, you know, we worry about. Yeah. We worry about a lot of things that don't, you know, the, the, the things we should be worrying about, we don't worry about. You know, yeah, that's 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 true. It's if, a process, if, if, but, you know. If, if, the, if the government was really about, or not, not just one guy, you know, I, I guess each government has, you can see it has their own fucking agenda, but, um, yeah. If the government's trying to help the people, then it's just, it sure seems like they're